watch this. Alright. <laughs> you pay attention now. That's Andrew Ryan on that screen. Now Ryan's got the formula. You get the trust you. Yourself heard. Stay! We may make more of you yet. Ryan's playing him all like a chicken fiddle. He plays, and all that they dance. It appears our time is up. Idiot! 
Just bomb. I made it! Belly in my prison, fighting how I defecate. What's next, martial law? Come back and clean it all up. immediately die of CO2 poisoning the moment we turn the thing on. Well, not the perfect phosphor frequency, but it'll do. Chung must have a supply stashed here somewhere. Overheating. There, everything's fixed. We're ready. Let's fire it up and see. First Lady Mark II was built around a particle lift system just like all the buildings in the city. I read all about it in the Columbian Scientific. The particle seated at the top of the structure must be up that lift. Perfect. Seems like a lot of technology just to float an airship. Comstock never heard of hydrogen. The First Lady Mark I did run on hydrogen and it was destroyed by a single bullet from a Vox sniper. Unfortunately, the Prophet wasn't on board at the time. If I take the active particle, then the First Lady is just a 40-ton paperweight. Best to take the spare. Here we go. Now let's head back through that tear. You honestly expect Atlas to honor his side of the deal? No, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. How do you plan on handling Atlas? He ain't just some spliced up maniac. He'll make a mistake. I just have to be ready to take advantage of it when it happens. All for a girl you barely know. How well did you know me when you came to Columbia? Pretty lady not finished yet. What? Open the tear. Power for the visor, very expensive. Eat for that? Just tell me what you want. So Chung wanted something as simple. Lock of hair. Oh, you're not serious. Not your hair, stupid. 
Pink Hodges Secret Lab. Mud bald, forgotten. In their hair sample. In jar. Cannot miss it. You get for sutra. Then everybody friends. Where's his lab? Closed off past Fink's quarters. Um, you smart lady, you find. Should have seen that one coming. The other you and I are probably inside the factory. On our way up to the First Lady. And what happens if we run into ourselves? We won't. How do you know that? Because we didn't. me good service, but I will not hurt the boy. I will see Fink and Comstock burn, but I will not hold the son to account for the deeds of his father. You've misunderstood us. We neither asked you to harm the child. Nor did we promise that yours would be the hand that would set Comstock's world afire. A famous man once said. And a famous man shall say. I may reach the mountaintop. But I fear I shall never visit the valley below. But you mean I won't live to see the... No. It's up to you what matters more. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Someone is coming. She'll arrive a girl. She must leave a woman. And what makes the difference between a girl and a woman? Blood. Your part in the play. Or the play itself. Turn her into a killer? How? Give the girl no choice. And she will be forced to make one.
you. There's a war coming. You can smell it in the air. Fear. Hatred. People dying every day. But how many more will suffer if we rise up? Violence begets violence. I know this. I've seen this. The rational mind argues for a peaceful solution to find a common ground, but what common ground is there to find for a father who watches his child bleed out in the street? I need to deny him his vengeance. I know that fire that burns deep inside. I know it all too well. And when the time comes, will I be able to stay to hand? Looks like the mechanism unlocks certain activities when Fink gives us blessing. So what? We're stuck waiting for the cuckoo to go off? No, there's a... there's a slot for some kind of key for manual winding. We just gotta find that. Sure seems like a lot of work to lock down a few doors. You know, if there's one thing Fink loves, it's a lot of work. current state of being, or lack thereof. We've got the clock key. Our current state of being, or lack thereof, has left my brother unfulfilled. The biological urge to leave one's mark is strong, and it is not an impossibility. We could instantiate ourselves back in Columbia. Return to an old life for the possibility of creating new. But we died in that world. Returning would mean giving up part of us. Ourselves. We'd become flesh and all that it is heir to. The mysteries of the universe would become once again mysteries. seen more evidence to the contrary than in support. You'd think he'd have put Adam into the belly of a nice little seagull or crow. 
the cost of all these underwater expeditions. Good. Now to get that idiot his lock of hair. humor me then? Please. I think Booker would miss you. 